Fireman Sam. Hurry, Uncle Sam. Oh. Quick, screw in the other end of this pole tightly to the tree. It's in tight, Sam. Well, you're all safe now. Hurry, Sam, hurry! My Norman is dangling by a finger. Hold on, Norman. Don't try, Sam. Ah. You're safe now, Norman. Penny. You hose down the grass, we'll get the floppy shovels. OK, Sam. I hope he gets here soon. Here he is, now! Come on, everyone. Let's get you to safety. Elvis, make sure everyone's OK. We need to get this fire under control. Penny, it's an inflatable rescue path. Ooh. Oh! Tie it to the end of the jetty, Penny, then hold it steady. Sarah, James, it's okay. We're coming to get you. Done. It's going to sink. Don't panic. I'm here. Got you. Get you out of here. It's no good. I'm stuck fast. Hang on a minute. It's not you that's stuck. It's your rucksack. This should do the trick. Thanks, Sam. Nice job. Firefighter, Penny. Firefighter, Sam. Power's off, Sam! We're losing. 
invisibility. Let's hope Saturn can see better than us. Anything? Come on, Saturn. I've got something. Saturn's found Norman on the secluded beach. Hold on! I've got you. Ready? Elvis, pull us in! Come in, Station Officer Steele. You can call Dillis. Norman Price is safe. Shall we use the sticky foam, Sam? No, Elvis. Just water for this one. Get it into position to drop water. Over. Thanks, Tom. Looks like we have the fire under control now. No problem, mate. There. Lost them. They're in a tricky spot. I'll use the winch. Can you get me any closer, Tom? to find a safe place where I can reach you. What are you doing, little sheep? He's showing you the way to safety. If you get up there, we'll be able to reach you. Second, Sarah. Hold on, Lily. Ah, your turn, Sarah. I'll drop you back on the mountain top, Sam. No need, Tom. I'll make my own way up. Yeah. Mandy, it's Fireman Sam. I'm coming to get you. <gasps> Please hurry, Sam. Lower the double harness, Tom. Coming right up. I can't hold on much longer, Sam. You don't have to, Mandy. I've got you. Sam. 
Elvis, you get everyone to safety. Okay, Sam. Penny, we're going to need the sticky foam. Okay, Sam. Come on, everyone. Get back behind Jupiter. You'll be safe there. Turn it on, Penny. Heads out, Penny. All safe. Phew. It's Fireman Sam! In position to move, Tom. Sonar navigating practice you've been doing, Elvis. We're going to take Titan up Ponty Pandy River. Ah! Oh! Wow, this thing. <laughs> Come on, me old girl. <laughs> you and me together again. <laughs> Sam, I'm on my way. Let's hope we can put it out quickly, Bessie, old girl. Your tanks aren't that big. <gasps> Station Officer Steel! Rocks, four degrees starboard. Look! Oh, no! <laughs> I'm coming to get you! Nipper! You take the boys to safety, sir. I'll get Nipper. Done, sir. You really kept that blaze at bay. Well, I have to say, it was a bit more exciting than counting paper clips. Chemicals are we dealing with? Elvis. Sodium! But there's all sorts of chemicals in there, Sam. Oh, I wonder what extinguisher Sam will use. I've got it! So have I! Because, because when in doubt, doubt you can fight fire with Sam. <laughs> you have got it! You put out the chemical fire, Elvis. I'll deal with everything else. Sam! He's 
not that far out, so I can use the harness helmet. I'm coming, Norman! Hang on, Norman! I'm nearly there! I can't do that much longer! My pants are filling with water! Now there's a coat I can use. I got you, Norman. Now hold on to me. This penny, it's an inflatable rescue path! Ooh! Oh! Tie it to the end of the jetty penny, then hold it steady. Sarah! James! It's okay! We're coming to get you! Done! It's going to sink! Don't panic! I'm here! Ben, you pilot type. Elvis and Penny, you man the water cannons. I'll take you. the boat downstream. Okay. Penny, launch Saturn in that direction. It'll find Steel and the others by sensing their body heat. Elvis, I need you to direct me through the dark. Okay, Sam. Sam. The rowing boat is at the top of the waterfall. You need to head 200 meters north, Sam, and quick! On my way. Ooh. He is doing this near! Oh, it's up for Sam! Gareth, I need you to tie the end of the rope to the boat! Turn in. Everyone is safe. Penny, take Neptune and collect the skiff. Let's move in. Ready, Elvis? 
Ready, Sam! Men, we need to move along the island and fast! Using the grappling hook. Right, you are, Sam. <laughs> oh! Looks like you've only got time for one more try, Sam. Chewing culprit. Good work, Sam. Oh, that's a relief. There you go, Lamikins. I think you need to find something a bit safer to eat. Nice to see you back on the ground, Lamikins, old friend. I'll take Juno, you two take Neptune. Looks like we'll need the new sonar. Look out for the lights that are bringing me home. Look! For high up... There they are! What? The lights that are bringing us home. Hey! Over here! Hello! Tom! Can you see anything, Tom? Nothing so far, Sam. Penny, is Charlie's boat showing up on Neptune's sonar? No, Sam. I think it's too small. But a whale isn't. If my brother's the sailor I know he is, they'll be pretty close to that whale. Scanning for the whale now, Sam. Can't see anything. Wait! I can see a shape. Yes, that looks like a whale. Four degrees south. Did you hear that, Tom? On the way. <laughs> I can see the whale. I must be close. There they are, Tom. Is everybody all right? Yes, sir. A bit cold and wet, but all right. Come on, let's get you all on to Neptune. Penny, you shut off the electricity. OK, Sam. I'll make sure everyone's all right. Air, 100%. Sparks is heading out to sea at speed on a rocket-powered hover cart. I'll take Juno, you two take Neptune. I might need backup. Have 
We're on our way, sir. Okay, everyone. Now it's time to ski. We'll zigzag back and forth across the avalanche zone, just like we practiced. Listen out for your transceiver, and when it beeps louder, the kids are close by. It's beeping louder, Sam. We're getting close. Hello, Sarah, Mandy. They're trapped in the hut. Great snowplow, Elvis. Huh? I got it. Oh, thanks, Penny. <laughs> Safe now. Thanks, Uncle Sam. You really shouldn't have gone beyond the boundary ropes. They're there to protect you from danger. When he hears that.